so it is 11 a.m. I'm helping my sister bring her car to the shop. I'm so freaking tired. There goes my alarm. I accidentally fell asleep like seven o'clock and um, woke up at like almost midnight and then was up until like almost five or six and then was sleep until she came over. So I'm up, I'm helping her and then I don't know how much time we'll have to maybe do something or something because I do work today. So I'll update you guys, today with you guys later. Hey, so it is 12.02 and I'm so tired still. And I need to do my hair. I'm thinking I might braid it because it's greasy. But I don't feel like washing it right now. <sighs> I'm so tired. Can't believe I had a shitty sleep like last night. Like usually I have a sh shitty sleep but yesterday was more than usual but yeah today is december 13th so that's a plus it's like what 12 more days till christmas so that's exciting um what's it called so i'm off tomorrow tomorrow i definitely need to get into the garage the basement and the craft room to clear out all my stuff and go through it and see what I'm gonna keep, what I'm not, and all that fun stuff. And probably like binge watch RuPaul's Drag Race while I'm at it. Um, <laughs> maybe chill with my friends know. Um, Stop at Home Depot tomorrow. See if I can find like, well, look at different flooring options. Um, I might go with like a laminate just because I know it's got a barrier with it instead of the stuff that I use for my photography stuff because it's just like a rolled like vinyl it's not like heating or nothing like there's no thickness in between the floor or whatever but I might go with the vinyl I don't know I'm gonna look at my options and I need to go measure my RV to see what I would need so then I can price out some options and probably go the cheapest route um, but yeah, flooring will be first, and then I need to safe seal everything so we don't get sick. <sighs> okay, that's like the main things I want to do, and then I need to, I'm still saving money up for tires because I need seven tires, and that's going to be like almost as much as I bought the RV for but I'm hoping to be in LA for DragCon um I don't know I wonder how much the tickets are I know VIP I'm a VIP kind of person because I like to pay for experiences but VIP is $300 and for three of us to three of us for two of us to go for $300 like that's a lot of money I don't know but 70, 80, 90. But it's like 150 regular tickets. So it'd be like 300 for both of us. But with the VIP experience, you get so much more VIP perks. You get a badge signed by RuPaul, a special collector's lanyard. Um, Extended hours, four hours extended all weekend. Um, priority lines for meeting the queens. Priority seating for panels. Um, exclusive bag. Yeah, we might have to just splurge on that. So exclusive bag, including a DragCon jacket and special pin. What? Okay, so see, I paid... About two fifty because I paid VIP for one day for LA Pride. They didn't have no type of perks besides a meal and two drinks. So that's fucking awesome. And then 
it says exclusive vip lounge open friday saturday sunday um vip exclusive cash bar in the lounge as well as food court and photo app and 10 percent off of merch there the vip does not exclude entrance into separate drag con parties i'm gonna see if i can possibly make this happen for my friend because i think she would love it and it's in march yeah it is march 24th 25th and 26th okay so i got a bit so that's cool but i might want to buy the tickets like asap in my rv i want my rv to be done before that because i'm ready to go i'm itching oh i need to stop yawning but i am itching to go like i just can't handle it anymore so tomorrow clean and go through shit all that fun stuff i need to go get my uniform out the dryer but tomorrow i'm gonna clean and all that get ready for that rumor sale so that's gonna be fun hopefully i make money <laughs> i don't see why not but yeah all right so i'll just end the vlog here so i'm gonna end the vlog here today's day 13 and it, yes it was a boring vlog um i didn't do much besides help my sister and she don't want to be on camera so i didn't vlog with her or anything um but yeah we just literally just went got her car from her house and then dropped it off at the dealership well not the dealership but like the place to get it fixed is part of a dealership and then i came home and i've just been sitting here for like the last like 30 no hour <laughs> so oh geez my laptop's falling all right so i'm gonna end the vlog here i will see you guys tomorrow in the next day of the vlog bye